So what's the challenge though? Why can't you stay in first place? Don't get on negative stocks. Too much money on our hands. Too much money on your hands? Too much money on our hands. Okay, so you're not, what, buying enough? We're not buying enough. Okay. We're just letting the money sit. All right. Buy the good products. Buy the good products. Definitely. All right, so now we're just taking a break. You're going into the second half. What is your strategy going in on the second half? Buying Samson. Get money <laughs> Get what? Get money off our hands. Get money up, right? Yeah. Okay. And how do you do that, though? Just you, Buy more. Are you listening to the hot tips? Are you listening to the news releases? You got to pay attention to, the, to the middle board. Right. The middle board is helping us out in the graphs at the end. All right. Very good. Now, let me ask you this. How do you think this experience is going to help you in your future? Make sure you buy good products when you're going up. <laughs> what do you think? What do you uh, think? I, I can't answer that yes, one. Yes, you can. That's a hard think one. Think about it. Think uh, about uh, it. This is a great experience, right? Is, yeah, how to use your right. money right. Exactly. How to invest. Invest. How to invest your money. Right? That's key. Well, you guys are doing a great job. I'm proud of you. You keep up the good work. Good luck for the second half because I want to interview the winners. And you're going to be interviewing us. Well, that's what I'm saying. Number one. Number one. I like Number that. One. I like it. All right, guys. Good luck. Okay, we are here with East High School team. Team Greatness is their name, and your name is? Savannah. Savannah. Danny. Danny. Xiomara. Xiomara. Love it. What grades are you guys in? I'm a freshman. Freshman? I'm a senior. Senior? Freshman. Okay. Listen, now I was just talking to them about how I, you know, I really haven't seen much of them in the top five. Give me your strategy for the next half to appear and stay in the top five. I think that we should, like, buy more stocks and Start selling when our money gets low. Right. Yeah. Okay. I think we, we need to buy more stocks. Like, we got to stop focusing on the little numbers and start gaining and buying big numbers. We're number four, so we got to 44 now, so we're trying yeah. to sell money. We got to start buying more stocks to gain money. That's but we'll be, we'll be number one by the end of the day. All right. You, you heard it here first. You heard it here first. I expect to see it. I want to call your names. First place. Okay? We'll go. because number one, they're just so stinking cute. That's the first thing. The second thing, I'm like, wait a minute, they're so little. What do you guys know about Wall Street and stocks and buying and selling and trading? Our school has like a club. Yeah? We have an investment club and it's every Wednesday, every other Wednesday uh -huh. that we go to and we practice. Wow. And we have like teams. You do? Yeah. What's your name? Uh, my name's Sophie. Sophie? Now, I will have to say, when I was up front, I saw you running all the way up front because you're so little, it's hard for you to see the screen back here, isn't it? Yes. But you know what? I like your ambition on how you took took charge and you went right up front. Great job. Thanks. Great job. Thank What's your name? I'm Tom. You're Tom. Yes. Now, what grade are you in? That's most important. Where I'm in the SDR in fifth. Oh, I'm in sixth. Fifth and sixth grade? And yeah. you're, you're participating in Stock Market Challenge? Yeah. I am impressed. These are these are financial gurus for the future. I'm standing here with the Bennett High School team and their coach, Dan Haig. Dan Haig, thank you so much for joining me today. And let me let me introduce the team too. Miles James. Amal James. Miles James. Miles James. My bad. Sorry. Aviana Hill. Aviana Hill. Angela Brown. 
Alexis Howard. All right. Okay, team, listen, I have to say this. Being MC, you guys definitely are the most vocal. <laughs> Thank you. That, that's a good thing, because when you need a trader, I think everybody in the hotel can hear you. <laughs> and I'll be helping you, right? Uh -huh. Yes, yes. What has the experience been like for you guys today? It's hard. It's hard. It's, it's hard, hard. It's but it's fun. different. Yeah. But it's time to experience to take in. Absolutely. But I totally do it again. Yeah. You would. Yeah. That I like to hear. What can you take away from today's experience that will help you in your future? Write down what you have. Write down what you have. Keep track. Okay. Keep track. Keep track. Keep track. Keep track. Your money on how to invest your money, right? Mm -hmm. yeah. So let me give you an example. You're in the store and you see some really nice shoes. I gotta say shoes because my ladies can relate to shoes. <laughs> shoes. And they're designer shoes and they're like, mm, $125. I need for you to say this again. You wait for them to go on sale to get the best deal possible. That's right. And the key word she said was best, best deal. deal. Best deal, sale, exactly. So that's what this experience is about. Dan, let me talk to you as their coach. Sure. What kind of experience has this been for you? Uh, you know, I think it's a really great experience, uh, you know, for myself to see, you know, how how the students, uh, you know, interact with one another and, and see how they can actually put their skills that they learn in the classroom to uh, a real life situation. Exactly. So I think this is definitely a great hands-on experience for them, and hopefully it'll benefit them after they graduate from school. So. Yes. Absolutely. Definitely. What do you teach at Bennett? I teach sports management, business computer applications, and marketing. Well, you're in the right place then. Absolutely. You're in the right place. So is this your first year? This is my first year taking them, yeah. Okay, so we're going to see you next year. Absolutely. Okay, listen. Bennett High School team. Yes. I'm wishing you major luck. Thank you. I want to see you in the top five during the second half, okay? Okay. All right, go team. Hi, we are back, and I am joined right now with Diane Gardner, who is the Senior Development uh, Manager for Junior Achievement of Western New York, along with President Lori Mahoney, President of uh, Junior Achievement. Thank you so much for joining me today. We are at Junior Achievement Stock Market Challenge uh, Student Edition. We just actually finished up, and it was so exciting. It was so exciting. I want to thank you for allowing me to MC the event this year. I had such a great time interacting with the students, watching them just, you know, take everything that was given to them and just running with it. They had a great time. Great time. We just had a teacher, one of our new teachers came up to us, said that even the kids who didn't win, who weren't on the lead, top leaderboard, had the best time. She said she noticed that all of the kids were engaged, every single one of them. So that was great. That you, you can't help but to be engaged. The energy on the floor was amazing. You know, even the little ones, I know we had a team uh, from a middle school mm -hmm. and, you know, they, they would run out to look to see at the boards and, and to see what to buy, what to sell, what to trade, you know. Yeah. That's exciting. Right. That's exciting. How did you guys come up with this whole concept? Well, it was something that we had heard about other junior achievement offices doing in the country, and it turns out that the company that puts us on is based in Toronto. Mm -hmm. So two years ago, we went to see how they did it in Toronto, and we were so excited. We knew that the kids just it really got them engaged. It got them excited about learning about the stock market, and so we decided we really needed to do it. So last year was our first event. It was so successful. We did it again. We had more schools this year. We had some more sponsors, more people involved, and we hope to get more even next year. So That's, that's exciting. Mm -hmm. That is very exciting. And like you said, you have more teams. It's 15 teams or no 15 schools 47 teams that's amazing that is amazing now Lori I know you're new you're the new president I am okay tell us a little bit about you like what what area you came from and what brought you here and, and your experience so far okay I am um, I've come from for the last 10 years I've been in the not-for-profit world I've really done development and fundraising. Mm -hmm. I started with Junior Achievement in April of this year, and I was really looking forward. I had heard great things about this event and the energy and all, and I think the nice thing about it that I like is the fact that it's so relevant to what's going on in the world today for kids to learn about how to take care of their money. That's true. I think it's just, it's a great program, and there's no better way to learn than by having fun. That's right. And learning at the same time, because you don't